All right. So you're probably wondering why we're here. Um, it's because I have been stuck in analysis paralysis for so long and I've been trying to figure out what to do with this darn YouTube channel. And I think I need to do a challenge. Hi, I'm Jamie Reynolds, and if you don't know me, I am a new YouTuber. I am in the effort of monetizing this channel. My background is in IT, and I just love reviewing different products, but I also like sharing my knowledge that I've gained with you on how I'm monetizing my social media platforms, how I'm making money with TikTok Shop and the Amazon Influencer Program. And the reason that I'm making this video is because I feel like I need to do a challenge. I need to up my game. I've been watching a video series from someone named Virginia Kerr. Kerr? I think it might be Kerr. And she did a 21 day, actually she's on, she's on day 20 today. She's gonna, 21 days is gonna be tomorrow for her. And I've been watching it every day and just loving it. Like I found her while she was doing the challenge and I was like, this is awesome. And I've attempted to make more videos, but as I'm making the videos, like I, I literally had like five or six minutes of content earlier and I deleted it all because I was like, getting into the weeds and I was like, you know what, let's do a challenge. And then as I'm doing the challenge, I can start building up what I'm doing, right? So I'm, so like for, you know, like for example, I am going to make a template for scripting my YouTube videos. I like the idea of knowing and planning what my thumbnail is gonna be, what my title of my video is gonna be, the main points. I don't wanna script word for word, but I was like, I want to know before I record what my intro is gonna be. You know, the first part of the video where I'm trying to hook the viewer in, right? And tell you what I'm talking about. And then I want to nail down my little intro where I say my name and what I, who I am. And then I want to get the meat and the potatoes of everything that I promised right in the hook, make sure I deliver on it and then have a nice ending. So I wanted to make a template because I feel like every time I make a video, I feel like I'm starting from scratch every time. And I don't want to do that. I really don't. I don't want to start from scratch every time. Sometimes I forget my microphone. Sometimes I don't really pay attention to the lighting or what I'm wearing. So I wanted to have like a little script slash um, checklist. The other thing too is if I don't know what I'm talking about before I start talking about it, I go too deep. I go too deep into the weeds and that's what happened earlier is I started making a video about the Amazon Associates program and I just sat there for like a good minute just like recording myself was and saying nothing because I was like lost. Like I didn't know where I was going anymore because I was getting into areas that I wasn't well versed in and then I felt like if I kept going, this video was gonna be like three hours long. <laughs> so I started thinking like, you know, maybe I need to break this stuff up and have, you know, four to five main points and then spawn off other videos on, on those points. The other thing I wanted to say is because of my background in, in IT, I am used to overthinking, overanalyzing, documenting, just going to, every extreme of like how could someone mess this up and how can i make sure that they don't mess it up like locking things down or um just documenting things just to the nth degree where like there really is no wiggle room there's nothing and to me that is exhausting that could take me you know a month to make a video if every video was like that so I don't want to do that anymore. So I started thinking I'm going to start this challenge. I don't even know how often I want to post. Virginia did a daily post for 20 days. Tomorrow will be 21. I don't know that I can commit to daily unless I can start getting my planning down and I can start having enough bullet points where I feel like, oh, this is a piece of cake. I can just, you know, make that video real, real fast where right now I feel very overwhelmed with the thought of explaining something that is so detailed that I'm be sitting there going, um, 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 and, and like I said, talking for three hours. I, I just, I don't have the stamina. I don't have the time, etc. So first for me will be to get a bank of ideas and get kind of like a skeleton outline of some of the videos that I plan to make. And then from there, I think I'm going to decide how often. Like I said, I don't think it's gonna be daily, but I would like to see myself post at least two times a week. I'm hoping for three times a week. If I can make my videos between five and six minutes, and under 10 minutes, 
three times a week, that should be doable. That really should be doable. The other thing is if I plan it ahead in time and I lightly script, you know, the outline, there shouldn't be so much to edit. Like I'm on a good roll right now because I kind of thought about what I was going to talk about before I talked about it. And then now I'm not messing up. You know what I mean? So <laughs> that's where I'm going to go. I'm going to make my outline. I started thinking about ways that I could make my outline. You know, some people like to make stuff on Canva. Sometimes Canva like can be a black hole for me. Like I could literally be working on something for five hours, be exhausted. And then by the time I'm done, I don't, I don't want to use it anymore. Kind of like when I'm cooking, <laughs> you know, like, like you've spent an hour, you know, prepping and chopping, cooking and, and, and then you're smelling everything that by the time dinner comes, you don't want to eat it anymore. So that's kind of how Canva is for me. I love it. I do love Canva but I can get overwhelmed. So then I thought, well, maybe I'll just make it in a Google sheet and put some, you know, simple borders around it. So that's what I'm gonna do after this video is I'm gonna start designing that, put all those little placeholders that I have and then print them out. Because that's the other thing too, that is another black hole. I'm like an out of sight, out of mind kind of person. And although I'm in IT, uh, files saved on my computer, uh, where are they? I mean, I mean, I know where they are, but like, I completely forget about them. I would like to have printed paper. Maybe that's the Gen X in me. I don't know. <laughs> printed paper where I can just, you know, write down my notes when they come to mind. I would also like to work on several videos at a time because like I mentioned earlier, I tend to go too deep into the weeds. I would like to see kind of like my creation and then go, okay, you know what? I can break this up even further into three more videos. So I'm going to start with that and see how this goes for me. And then I'll make an update. So after I have created my little file, I will make another video. So the video will be kind of going over the file that I've created and then some sample video, uh, stuff that I put, uh, not sample, it'll be real videos, right? It's going to be real things that I want to record. I'll show you that. I'll show you what I put on my file and then we will go from there. So if you're interested, leave me a comment down below. If you want to get in on this challenge, you can copy my challenge. You can go over to Virginia Kerr's page, copy her challenge, make up your own challenge. You know, it, there's no rules here. <laughs> there's literally no rules. You don't have to do what other people do, but I think it is good to be inspired by other people. I am constantly inspired by other people to just kind of break out of my shell, you know, do something different. And this challenge is, is no, no different than that. So, um, yeah, I think that's, that's all I wanted to say today. This is going to be a series. This is going to be a playlist and I hope that you follow along. So I'm going to put a link to that video. I don't even know which side it's going to be on when it's done the video where I go over the file that I made. I'll even give you a copy of it if you want, but I will put it right here when it's done. It's not done. If you don't see that little thumbnail here and there's another video in that spot, then you'll know that it's not done, but just give me a few days and I'll have that video up for you and We'll see what happens. All right. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.